Hello beautiful people, welcome to my African Village TV, your guide to the hidden treasures of Africa. Today I want to talk to you guys about Kalavi. This beautiful province in Benin Republic is attracting people who are looking for a better quality of life, a lower cost of living and a greener environment. Kalavi is located about 18 kilometers from Kotonou. It has a population of about 656,000 people and it is home to the largest public university in the country. In this video, I will tell you some of the new projects that are transforming Kalavi such as the new Dantopa Market, Second Warmer Bridge and all you need to know about the Glojin Bay Industrial Zone. Again, most importantly, I've said this in my previous videos, this current government of His Excellency President Talon Patrice is currently moving the government administrative services to this amazing province of Calavi. In other words, this would imply that most of the embassies would have to relocate their offices and services to this province and some of them might end up having two embassies in this country so you know what that means so if you are thinking of relocating or thinking about a city or a province to relocate to in Benin Republic think about Kalavi Kalavi was founded as a small village to facilitate trade and commerce but it grew rapidly in the 70s and 80s as in more people moved from rural areas to urban centers today Kalavi is a vibrant and diverse city with a mix of modern and traditional cultures it has a strong educational sector with several schools colleges and universities it also has a thriving agricultural sector with crops such as cassava, maize, rice and vegetables. Kalavi is also well known for its arts and crafts. However, the city is also working hard to improve its infrastructure, services and living standards. For example, the government is building new roads, bridges, metro station, markets and public facilities to enhance its connectivity, mobility and accessibility. It is also implementing various projects and programs to promote sustainable development, social inclusion and economic growth. So one of the most important projects is the construction of the second warming bridge which will span the lagoon of Jono and connect Kalavi to Kotono. The bridge will have a total length of 326 meters and it will reduce the travel time and distance between the two cities and ease the traffic congestion and pollution. The bridge will also boost the economic and social activities of both cities and create more jobs and income for the local people. Another major project is the relocation of the new Dantopa market, which is one of the largest open-air markets in West Africa and one of the most important retailing areas in Benin Republic. The market is being relocated to Abome Kalavi. Another exciting development is the new Glow Jibe Industrial Zone. Guys, I was here myself with my team and this place need a revisitation. I'm going to revisit this particular place because it is just so mind-blowing that you can't help but to appreciate and recognize and acknowledge the great works that this current administration is doing under the leadership of His Excellency President Talon.
just 10 minutes from Calavi Central, spans 300 hectares and aims to position Benin Republic as a manufacturing hub for West Africa. It is equipped to support large-scale textiles, agro-processing, automobile assembly and logistics enterprises, providing ready factory sheds and pre-installed utilities for manufacturing. Just so you know, we also have a video of this great and amazing Glojin Bay Industrial Zone. I encourage you guys to watch it. The zone is expected to offer employment to over 50,000 people and contribute significantly to Benin's GDP growth. And so guys, Calavi has a dynamic and diverse economy that is based on several sectors and industries such as education, agriculture, tourism, arts and craft, trade and commerce. Calavi offers many opportunities for entrepreneurs, investors and workers who want to benefit from the city's potential and growth. Yes, guys, if you're an entrepreneur and you're looking for a place to do your business without much competition in Benin Republic, think about Alavi. I've lived here myself for more than two years. It is a beautiful place to be. If you're someone who wants to do your thing, you don't want many eyes, you don't want many competition, you love to lead a calmer life, you want to have access to the most organically and naturally grown food in this country, think about Calavi. And you know what guys, this province have got one of the lowest costs of living compared to the other cities like Cotonou and other places. It has a green environment. There are trees everywhere. So cool, even under the hot sun, you don't feel it. Calavi is definitely a city that is worth exploring as it has a lot to offer to its visitors and residents. It is a city that is changing and improving while preserving its culture and identity. Hey, if you have not subscribed, go ahead and do that because there is a huge project coming on this space. We are going to bring to you guys a whole African village in this Benin Republic, living and existing and running their activities and day-to-day -day life on the water. That will be mind-blowing. Stay tuned to that video. Thank you so much for watching this video up until this time. And I thank you for sharing our video. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for being a part of this amazing YouTube community. Thank you so much for being a part of our African village people. I will see you in the next video and until then, I am Splendor. Bye for now.